almost knocked that thing down. My, my little brother, Betty. My little brother, Anthony. Yeah, I almost destroyed your office here. That would be a catastrophe. We've got the archives here. We yeah. can't do no destruction there. Talking about destruction. I told you I lived in Langa for a while. And I was with uh, young people, you know, young, young men, to tell you the truth, you know. They needed some guidance. They thought I could give it to them. Of course, I don't give nobody no guidance. <laughs> you gotta guide yourself. Mm -hmm. But the important thing about it is that, you know, I realized, uh, you know, the, the, everybody was damaged. No, when I say everybody was damaged, I mean, you know, I'm damaged too. I mean, I came from the, you know, I come from the South Bronx. We were all damaged to some degree you know, on the planet, you know. Mm -hmm. But it, 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 it really gets me to thinking now. Uh, it's like a, Maybe what's going on in the world today, what, I, what, what I'm calling the, the male angst, is that uh, the damaged have taken over, you know, some sort of critical mass of damaged dudes <laughs> are doing the thing. Now, you say, well, we I mean damaged. Well, look, I, I forgot to tell you, I don't know if I told you this before, but um, see, I was in the, uh, the Air Force, but one of my, my jobs, or AFSC or something like that, what did they call it like that, and they give you a number nine or whatever, whatever it was, right? And uh, mine was a, I was a medical technologist, lab technician, you know, it's the cat that draw your blood, you know, mm -hmm. and, then, and, then, and then do the tests and give the results to the doctor, which means I know a whole lot about medicine. Oh. Of course, because you know the lab technician, he knows, he knows a little bit, but the doctors know. In fact, the whole thing about being that kind of thing is, you, is a language, you know, so you learn the language and blah, 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 that's not the point. But I had the opportunity to look through an electronic microscope, mm -hmm. you know, that was way back when, that's in the, like the 70s, you know, when it was whatever. But you know, one of the things is that you do realize that the female has like an X, X chromosome, you know. And then the male can either have an XX chromosome or an XY chromosome. Usually it's the XY makes the makes the male. And I think in some like uh, insects they have like an XO. You know, the XO would be the male and the XX is the female. But for the most part, a male is an XY. Now if you look at that, I'm looking at that, I'm saying like, wait a second. If you have a X and an X and you break off you know, one of them X's, you got an XY. That means that's a damage there. That's some damage there, because XX is not damaged, but the X break that thing off, that's a, that's a damage. But that's just my interpretation. But then I got to thinking, wait a second, let's take, now I don't want to go this route, but I have to just, just say this, because it seemed like this is where the men you know, did their thing. You know, back, back in the, 1600s, whenever it was in England, where you know, I told you when 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 King James and the dudes and whatever, whatever they got together and they they edited the Bible, somebody said, "Hey, you know, woman comes from the man's rib, you know, mm -hmm. as if you know the rib broke off, <laughs> and that was a woman." But that couldn't be possible. It's got to be the other way around. Then I'm thinking, see, I'm now now I'm thinking I'm going to modern times. Like, hey, you know, somebody I think it was the 70s. There was this thing. No, like a projection. If if you think that something's going to happen, right? You project it onto your 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 enemy, and accuse them of that, even though you was the one that was a, the culprit, so to speak. You see. So I'm going like, hey, maybe what's happening in the world today? The the men are all projecting their damaged their damaged state on women, because you know, women are not. Project, you know, they, 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 you know, women in golf, they don't penetrate. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So, I, I, uh, so I'm just thinking. They look, I, I, look, I'm just an audio dramatist. It's just me now. It make no sense to nobody but me, you know, and, and the rest and some other audio dramatists is writing some script or something like that. But I'm just saying, it just seems to me that if you want to start solve the world problem, you know, you got to make. The dudes know that hey, they damaged, and you 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 can't be leading nothing or doing nothing if you're a damaged person because you ain't whole. You know. And then you say, what well, about these women? That well, I don't know about them women. I'm talking about the men because I'm a man. I'm talking about the men. You know, I, that's our problem. The women ain't got no problem. The men got the problem. In fact, we all got the problem. <laughs> well, look. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Man, look, it's, it, 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 it may just be in my mind that the problem is because you know this one of them dispatches from the arts director emeritus. Uh, uh, wait a second. Hey, you know that would be me. Like T. I won't be damaged here. T from the Pattersons taking the train to Tibet, letting you know. But I only suspect.